Welcome to a first in a series of Cadden Connect instructional videos. Today's video we are going to focus on getting your account set up and logging in. You'll receive a login password from Cadden uh, that is connected to your personal email. You can then go to the Cadden Connect page for your community. Uh, today for this demonstration we're using a demo site. Uh, you'll have a specific web address for your community. You'll go up to the right hand side here at login, click, enter your email and password. Click login. What shows up first is the main news page. You're going to then go to the top right hand side under my account the first item profile, if you click on that, this is where you can enter the information you would like to share with your fellow homeowners. Uh, it's up to you how much information you want to include. Uh, if you don't want to include any information, that that's fine, but you can add your email address, your phone address, that can all be included. Under profile, we have settings, click on that, and here is where you can control how you receive information about your community. If you prefer to receive by email, you can use that. These settings here, uh, different categories, may vary for your community on what they want to include. Uh, and then, as you see here on the right, you can decide whether you want to be notified daily if a announcement goes out for one of these, weekly, or not to be notified at all. So it's up to you to choose which of these items you find important. Uh, to have the community stay in touch with you. You also have a choice whether or not you want to receive your communications by email. If we scroll down, you'll see text messaging as an option or a mobile app notification. So you could do one or all of these. Once you've picked which way you'd like to be notified, you can click update and that will update that information. The next item under my account my activity, you click on that, and you'll see different things that you have done through the website. Uh, in this case, our homeowner in the demo site has joined the biking club and has been approved for membership there. Uh, other items are on here. Notice update, if you click view under the item, it gives you some more de detail. In this case, our imaginary homeowner has opened up a, a ARC form and it shows the various uh, things that have transpired with that ARC request. I'm going to go back up to the top here. Notices and requests. This is an overview of all the items whether uh, that you've been involved with. Uh, CCNR notices, work orders, architectural requests. So these will vary depending on uh, what things you submit to your HOA. You'll also see here payments. Uh, if you have used payments before through the website, this has stayed the same. If you click on payments, make a payment, it takes you back to the Cadden website just uh, like it used to be. So it's the same setup there. I'm going to close that window. Support. If you have questions about using your community's Cadden Connect website, there's a series of different subjects that are covered and the company neighbor network we work with you can contact them and they can help you with these items you can also contact your community manager and that covers today's video if you have any other questions please contact your community manager at 520-297-0797 thanks